The Axis leaders of World War II were important political and military figures during World War II. The Axis was established with the signing of the Tripartite Pact in 1940 and pursued a strongly militarist and nationalist ideology, with a policy of anti-communism. During the early phase of the war, puppet governments were established in their occupied nations. When the war ended, many of them faced trial for war crimes. The chief leaders were Adolf Hitler of Germany, Benito Mussolini of Italy and Emperor Hirohito of Japan. Unlike what happened with the Allies, there was never a joint meeting of the main Axis heads of government, although Mussolini and Adolf Hitler did meet on a regular basis. <laughs> Kingdom of Bulgaria 1941 Boris III was the Tsar from 1918 until his death in 1943. Simeon II was Tsar of Bulgaria from 1943 until 1946, was underage and did not have any power. Kirill, Prince of Bulgaria, head of the Regency Council, 1943–44. Bogdan Filov, Prime Minister, 1940–43, member of the Regency Council, 1943–44. Dobri Bojilov, Prime Minister, 1943–44. Ivan Ivanov Bagrianov was Prime Minister in 1944. He attempted to pull Bulgaria out of the war and declare neutrality. Konstantin Muraviev, Prime Minister, 1944, Bulgarian Agrarian National Union. Kimon Georgiev, Prime Minister, 1944-46. Zvano Alexander Sankov, Prime Minister of the Bulgarian Government in Exile. Nikola Makov was a lieutenant general, Minister of Defense of Bulgaria Konstantin Lukash was a lieutenant general, Chief of Staff of the Bulgarian Army Stoyan Stoyanov was the highest scoring Bulgarian fighter ace of the Royal Bulgarian Air Force with 14 victories. Ferdinand Kozovsky was a lieutenant general in the Bulgarian who served as the chairman of the National Assembly of Bulgaria from 1950 to 1965. Damian Velchev was a Bulgarian Colonel General, Minister of Defense of Bulgaria. Vladimir Stachev was a Bulgarian Colonel General, Diplomat and Horse Rider. The Third Reich Nazi Germany. Adolf Hitler was leader of Nazi Germany, first as Chancellor from 1933 until 1934. He later became Germany's Führer from 1934 until his suicide in 1945. Hitler came to power during Germany's period of crisis after the Great War. During his rule, Germany became a fascist state with a policy of antisemitism that led to the Holocaust. Hitler pursued an extremely aggressive foreign policy that triggered World War II. He committed suicide on April 30, 1945 along with Eva Braun his long-term mistress whom he had married less than 24 hours before they committed suicide. Joseph Goebbels was Minister for Public Enlightenment and Propaganda from 1933 until 1945. An avid supporter of the war, Goebbels did everything in his power to prepare the German people for a large-scale military conflict. He was one of Hitler's closest associates and most devout followers. After Hitler's suicide, Goebbels and his wife Magda had their six children poisoned and then also committed suicide. He became Chancellor for one day before his death. Hermann Göring was Reichsmarschall and Prime Minister of Prussia. Within the short life of the Third Reich, Göring held a variety of public offices heaped upon him by Hitler. He was the Commander-in-Chief of the Luftwaffe, President of the Reichstag, Original Head of the Gestapo, Minister of Economics, Paramount Chief of the War Economy, Head of the Four-Year Plan, Reichmarschall of the Greater German Reich, Minister of the Forests of the Third Reich and finally Defendant No. 1 at the Nuremberg Trials. Hitler awarded Göring the Grand Cross of the Iron Cross for his successful leadership. Originally, Hitler's designated successor, and the second highest ranking Nazi official. However, by 1942, with his power waning, Göring fell out of favor with the Führer, but continued to be the de jure second in command of the Third Reich. Göring was the highest ranking Nazi official brought before the Nuremberg trials. He committed suicide with cyanide before his sentence was carried out. Heinrich Himmler became the second in command of Nazi Germany following Göring's downfall after the repeated losses of the Luftwaffe which the Reichsmarschall commanded, as Supreme Commander of the Home Army and Reichsfuhrer SS. 
As commander of the Schutzstaffel SS, Himmler also held overall command of the Gestapo. He was the chief architect of the final solution, and through the SS was overseer of the Nazi concentration camps, extermination camps, and Einsatzgruppen death squads. He held final command responsibility for annihilating subhumans who were deemed unworthy of living. Shortly before the end of the war, he offered to surrender Germany to the Western Allies if he was spared from prosecution as a Nazi leader. Himmler committed suicide with cyanide after he became a captive of the British Army. Joachim von Ribbentrop was the German Minister of Foreign Affairs from 1938 to 1945. He was condemned to death at Nuremberg and hanged. Karl Donitz was made Grodmoral of the Kriegsmarine on 30 January 1943 and was president for 23 days after Hitler's suicide. Under his command the U-boat fleet conducted unrestricted submarine warfare during the Battle of the Atlantic. After the war he was tried at Nuremberg and sentenced to 10 years in prison. Lutz Graf Schwerin von Krausig was leading minister of the German Reich in the short-lived Flensburg government in 1945. Martin Bormann was head of the party chancellery and private secretary to Adolf Hitler. He gained Hitler's trust and derived immense power within the Third Reich by controlling access to the Führer and by regulating the orbits of those closest to him. Rudolf Hess was Hitler's deputy in the Nazi party. Hess hoped to score a stunning diplomatic victory by sealing a peace between the Third Reich and Britain. He flew to Scotland in an attempt to negotiate peace, but was arrested. He was tried at Nuremberg and sentenced to life imprisonment. Albert Speer was German Minister of Armaments from 1942 until the end of the war, in which position he was responsible for organizing most of the logistical aspects of Germany's war effort. He was tried at Nuremberg and sentenced to 20 years in prison. Alfred Rosenberg was a German philosopher and an influential ideologue of the Nazi Party. He is considered one of the main authors of key National Socialist ideological creeds, including its racial theory, persecution of the Jews, Lebensraum, abrogation of the Treaty of Versailles, and opposition to degenerate modern art. During the war he headed the NSDAP Office of Foreign Affairs and later the Reich Ministry for the Occupied Eastern Territories. After the war he was condemned to death at Nuremberg and hanged. Reinhard Heydrich was SS Obergruppenführer General and General der Polizei, chief of the Reich Main Security Office including the Gestapo, Kripo, and SD and Stellvertretender Reichsprotector Deputy, Acting Reich Protector of Bohemia and Moravia in what is now the Czech Republic. Heydrich served as president of the ICPC later known as Interpol and was one of the main architects of the Holocaust. He died of wounds from an assassination attempt in Prague 1942. Ernst Kaltenbrunner was an SS Obergruppenführer. He was appointed by Himmler as chief of the SD in January 1943. The SIPO made up of the combined forces of the Gestapo Secret State Police and the Kripo Kriminalpolizei and the RSHA Reichsschauptamt, after Reinhard Heydrich's assassination. Further, Kaltenbrunner was in command of the Einsatzgruppen death squads. He was the highest-ranking SS leader to face trial at Nuremberg and be executed. Wilhelm Canaris was a German admiral, and chief of the Abwehr, the German military intelligence service, from 1935 to 1944. During the Second World War, he was among the military officers involved in the clandestine opposition to Adolf Hitler and the Nazi regime. He was executed in the Flossenburg concentration camp for the act of high treason. Wilhelm Keitel was an army general and the chief of the OKW, the Oberkommando der Wehrmacht or High Command of the German military, throughout the war. He was condemned to death at Nuremberg for the commission of war crimes and hanged. Alfred Jodl was an army general and operations chief of the OKW throughout the war. Like his chief, Keitel, he was condemned to death at Nuremberg and hanged. Franz Halder was a German general and the chief of the OKH, Oberkommando des Heers, from 1938 until September 1942, when he was dismissed after frequent disagreements with Hitler. Kurt Zeitzler was a German general and the chief of the OKH, from 1942 until July 1944. Walther von Brochich was commander-in-chief of the army from 1940 until his dismissal in December 1941, when Hitler took personal command of the army. Eric Redder was Grodmoral of the Kriegsmarine Navy from 1 April 1939 until 30 January 1943. 
Fedor von Bock served as the commander of Army Group North during the invasion of Poland in 1939 and commander of Army Group B during the invasion of France in 1940. Following the invasion of the Soviet Union in 1941, he was named commander of Army Group Center and commanded Operation Typhoon, the ultimately failed attempt to capture Moscow during the winter of 1941. His final command was that of Army Group South in 1942 before being dismissed by Hitler. He was killed by British aircraft on May 4, 1945. Albert Kesselring was a German Luftwaffe general. He served as commander of Luftflotte II for the early part of the war, commanding air campaigns in West and East, before being assigned as commander-in-chief of German forces in the Mediterranean, a position he would occupy for most of the war, commanding German forces in the defense of Italy. In March 1945, he became the last German commander-in-chief in the West. Gerd von Rundstedt was a general Feldmarschall field marshal in the German army and held some of the highest field commands in all phases of the war. He commanded large formations during the invasion of Poland and Battle of France. During Operation Barbarossa, he was named commander of Army Group South. In 1942 he was appointed commander of Ob West. He retained this command with several interruptions until his dismissal by Hitler in March 1945. Erich von Manstein is credited with the drawing up of the Ardennes invasion plan of France. In the Soviet campaign, he also conquered Sevastopol in 1942 and was then made General Feldmarschall and took command of Army Group South. A command he held until he was dismissed by Hitler in March, 1944. He is often considered one of the finest German strategists and field commanders of World War II. Heinz Guderian was the principal creator of Blitzkrieg. He commanded several front-line armies in the early years of the war, most notably Panzergruppe Guderian during Operation Barbarossa. Guderian later served as Chief of Staff of the Army from July 1944 to March 1945. Erwin Rommel was the commander of the Africa Corps in the North African Campaign and became known by the nickname, The Desert Fox. Rommel was admired as a tactical genius by both Axis and Allied leaders during the war. He was subsequently in command of the German forces during the Battle of Normandy. He was forced to commit suicide on October 14, 1944 for being implicated in the July 20 plot against Hitler. Walter Model was a general in the German army who became best known as a skilled practitioner of defensive warfare on both the eastern and western fronts. Following the invasion of Normandy in June, 1944 he was reassigned to the west where he took command of Army Group B. He was also the principal architect of the Ardennes Offensive. He committed suicide on April 21, 1945. Hans-Jürgen von Arnhem was a German colonel general and commander-in-chief of the Army Group Africa and de facto commander of the Africa Corps from March 9, 1943 until his capture by the British Indian Army's 14th Infantry Division on May 12, 1943. <laughs> Kingdom of Hungary 1940 Miklos Horthy was the supreme regent head of state from 1920 until 1944. Laszlo Bardasi was his prime minister from 1941 until 1942. After World War II, Bardasi was tried by a people's court in November 1945. He was sentenced to death and executed in 1946. Miklos Kale was prime minister from 1942 until 1944. Dome Stoje was Prime Minister from March until August 1944. Stoje was captured by American troops and extradited to Hungary in October 1945, after which time he was tried by a Communist People's Tribunal in Budapest. He was sentenced to death and executed in 1946. Geza Lakatos was a general in the Hungarian army during World War II who served briefly as Prime Minister, under Governor Miklos Horthy from August 29, 1944 until October 15 the same year. Ferenc Szalasi was the leader of the fascist Aero Cross Party, the leader of the Hungarian nation, Nemzit Vezeto, and the Prime Minister from 1944 to 1945. He was tried by the People's Tribunal in Budapest. He was sentenced to death and executed in 1946. Bela Miklos was acting as Prime Minister, at first in opposition, from 1944 to 1945. Karoli Bartha was a Colonel General, Minister of Defense. 
Ferenc Fekidhami Chedner Ferenc Shambathelyi was a Colonel General, Chief of the General Staff. Ferenc Farkas de Kisbarnak Ivan Hindi was a Colonel General in the Hungarian Army. He orchestrated the defense of Budapest. Hindi was captured by the Soviets on February 11, 1945, when he tried to escape just prior to the fall of the city on February 13. He was sentenced to death and executed in 1946. Gustav Janey was the commander of the Hungarian forces at the Battle of Stalingrad. Zoltán Shugi was the commander of the St. Laszlo Infantry Division. Laszlo Hari was the commander of the Hungarian Air Force. Elmer Garandi Novak was the commander of the Hungarian Third Army. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Imperial State of Iran, 1941. Reza Shah was the Shah of Iran from 1925 until 1941. Reza Shah was a reformist who modernized Iran during his rule. During World War II, Reza Shah had a policy of neutrality, continuing relations with Nazi Germany and Fascist Italy, and refusing to expel their citizens when requested to by the British. Fearing that Iran's oil would fall under Nazi control, and wishing to ensure communications between them, Britain and the USSR invaded Iran. Reza Shah was deposed and went into exile in South Africa. His son, Mohammad Reza Pahlavi, took the throne and brought Iran into line with the Allied powers. Muhammad Ali Farugi, Iranian minister and diplomat. Fazlallah Zahidi was an Iranian general during the Anglo-Soviet invasion of Iran. Zahidi was named military governor of Khuzestan province, the hub of Iran's oil industry. When the British invaded, he was arrested and held in Palestine until 1945. After World War II he became prime minister. Kingdom of Iraq 1941. Faisal II of Iraq was King of Iraq Rashid Ali al Kailani was Prime Minister of Iraq in 1940 and 1941. He overthrew the pro-British Nuri Said Pasha and established an anti-British regime. Britain responded with severe economic sanctions against Iraq and an invasion. The Anglo-Iraqi War ended with a British victory and Ali al Kailani out of power. Haj Amin al-Husseini was the Grand Mufti of Jerusalem who had been exiled from the British Mandate of Palestine for his nationalist activities. Husseini issued a fatwa for a holy war against British rule in May 1941. The Mufti's widely heralded proclamation against Britain was declared in Iraq, where he was instrumental in the anti-British Iraqi revolt. Kingdom of Italy 1940 Italian Social Republic 1943 Victor Emmanuel III of Italy was King of Italy and the Supreme Head, with Mussolini, of the Royal Italian Army. From 1935 he became Emperor of the Italian Empire. He supported Mussolini in 1922 during the March on Rome and he named him Prime Minister. In 1943, after successive military defeats, he, along with Marshal Pietro Badoglio, dissolved the fascist government, dismissed and arrested Mussolini and arranged an armistice with the Allies, setting up a royalist government in southern Italy led by the Marshal. Benito Mussolini was Prime Minister of the Kingdom of Italy from 1922 until 1943. The founder of fascism, Mussolini made Italy the first fascist state, using the ideas of nationalism, militarism, anti-communism and anti-socialism combined with state propaganda. In 1925, he assumed dictatorial powers as the Duce leader of fascism, and was subsequently called Duce by his fascist supporters. From 1925, King Victor Emmanuel III delegated his powers to Mussolini and opposition to Mussolini and the fascist state was seen as treason. Though his regime influenced Adolf Hitler and Nazi Germany, Mussolini did not subscribe to Nazi racial theories, dismissing them as mythical and fabricated. Only in 1938, under increased pressure from Hitler, did he adopt antisemitism as a state policy, and opposed the deportation of Jews by the Germans from Italian territory. Mussolini was the official head of the Milizia Voluntaria per la Sicurezza Nazionale, MVSN, Volunteer Militia for National Security often called the Blackshirts, who were fascist partisans loyal specifically to him, rather than the king. 
Successive military defeats from 1941, culminating in the Battle of El Alamein in 1942 and the Allied invasion of Sicily in July 1943, led to Mussolini and his government's dissolution and dismissal by the king. Arrested on the orders of the king, Mussolini was rescued by the Germans and became the puppet head of state of the Italian Social Republic regime under control of Nazi Germany in northern Italy. Mussolini was executed by Italian partisans on 28 April 1945, while attempting to flee to Spain. Pietro Badoglio was marshal of the army. He led the Italian army during the Second Italo-Abyssinian War. He resigned in 1940 after the Italian defeat in Greece. In 1943 he arranged with the Allies for an armistice and set up a royalist government in southern Italy Brindisi. Hugo Cavallero was the head of the Italian Royal Army during the Second World War, his powers being delegated to him from the King, who was the official supreme commander of the Italian Royal Army. He led Italian forces during the Greco-Italian War in which Italian forces faltered badly. Italo Garibaldi was the commander of the Italian forces at the Battle of Stalingrad. Arturo Riccardi was the head of the Italian Royal Navy Regia Marina from 1940 to 1943, his powers being delegated to him from the King, who was the official supreme commander of the Italian Royal Navy. Inigo Campioni was a commander of the Italian Royal Navy during the battles of Taranto, Cape Spartavento, and Calabria. Angelo Iacchino succeeded Campioni as commander of the Royal Italian Navy. Italo Balbo was the most important person of the Italian Royal Air Force Regia Aeronautica from the 1930s until his death in 1940. His powers were officially delegated to him from the King, who was the official supreme commander of the Italian Royal Air Force. He also commanded the 10th Army in Libya until his death. Galeazzo Ciano was appointed Minister of Foreign Affairs in 1936 by Mussolini who was also his father-in-law and remained in that position until the end of the fascist regime in 1943. Ciano signed the Pact of Steel with Germany in 1939 and subsequently the Tripartite Pact with Germany and Japan in 1940. Ciano attempted to convince Mussolini to bring Italy out of the war as casualties mounted but was ignored. In 1943, Ciano supported the ousting of Mussolini as Prime Minister. Ciano was later executed by fascists in the Italian Social Republic for betraying Mussolini. Rodolfo Graziani was commander of Italian North Africa and Governor-General of Libya. Graziani was ordered to invade Egypt by Mussolini. Graziani expressed doubts about the ability of his largely unmechanized force to defeat the British, however, he followed orders and the 10th Army attacked on September 13. He resigned his commission in 1941 after being defeated by the British in Operation Compass. Graziani was the only one of the Italian marshals to remain loyal to Mussolini after Dino Grandi's Grand Council of Fascism coup, and was appointed Minister of Defense of the Italian Social Republic Repubblica Sociale Italiana, or RSI. Graziani had under his command the mixed Italo-German LXXXXVII Liguria Army of the RSI. Giovanni Messa was the commander of the Italian Expeditionary Corps in Russia Corpo di Spedizioni Italiano in Russia, or CSIR. The CSIR fought on the Eastern Front, fighting with German forces against the Soviet Union. He later led Axis forces in the Tunisia campaign. He is considered by many to be the best Italian general of the war. Alfredo Gazzoni was commander-in-chief of the Italian forces during the Allied invasion of Sicily. Rhino Corso Fugger was a general in the Royal Italian Air Force and Chief of Staff 1941-43. Giuseppe Fioravanzo was one of the «intellectuals» of the Regia Marina, he was one of the main authors of the development of Italian naval doctrine between the two world wars. Junio Valerio Borghese was the commander of the Decima Flottilia Moss. Empire of Japan Hirohito posthumously known as Emperor Showa, was the emperor from 1926 until his death in 1989. He was viewed as a semi-divine leader. He was commander of the Imperial General Headquarters from 1937 to 1945 and authorized in 1936, by imperial decree, the expansion of Shiro Ishii's bacteriological research unit, while, according to some authors, assuming control over the use of chemical and bacteriological weapons. 
His generals took the full blame and he was exonerated from criminal prosecution, with all members of the imperial family, by the supreme commander of the Allied Powers SCAP. Fumimaro Kano was Prime Minister from 1937 to 1939 and 1940 until 1941. Kano authorized the publications of Kokutai no Hongi and Shinmen no Michi He joined the military to recommend to Emperor Showa the invasion of China and launched the National Spiritual Mobilization Movement, the League of Diet members believing the objectives of the Holy War and the Taisei Yokosankai to promote a total war effort. Kano was opposed to war with the Occidental powers. During the occupation of Japan, he refused to collaborate with the supreme commander of the Allied powers to exonerate Hirohito and the imperial family of criminal responsibility and came under suspicion of war crimes. He committed suicide in 1945. Hironuma Kiichiro was prime minister from 5 January 1939 to 30 August 1939. He was convicted of war crimes and sentenced to life imprisonment. Nobuyuki Abe was a general in the Imperial Japanese Army, Governor General of Korea, and Prime Minister of Japan from 30 August 1939 to 16 January 1940. Mitsumasa Yonai was Prime Minister in 1940 and Minister of the Navy from 1937 to 1939 and 1944 to 1945. During his second mandate as Navy Minister, the Imperial Japanese Navy implemented the Takotai or suicide units against the Allied fleet. He cooperated with SCAP to fix the testimony of the senior officers accused in the Tokyo trials and was exonerated from criminal prosecutions. Hideki Tojo was Supreme Military Leader from 1936 until 1944 and Prime Minister from 1941 until 1944. He was a strong supporter of the tripartite pact between Japan, Germany and Italy. Minister of War in the second cabinet of Fumimaro Kano, he was chosen as Prime Minister by the Emperor in October 1941. He was a main proponent of the war against the Occidental powers. Tojo strengthened the Taisei Yokosankai to create a single-party state. He was demoted in July 1944 by the Emperor, following the Battle of Saipan and condemned to death by the Tokyo Tribunal and executed. Kuniaki Koiso was a senior army general who served as prime minister from July 1944 to April 1945. Kantaro Suzuki was an admiral who served as prime minister from April to August 1945. He agreed to Japan's surrender to the Allies on August 15, 1945. Sadao Araki was minister of the army from 1931 to 1933 and education minister from 1938 to 1939. Araki was one of the main proponents of militarism and expansionism during the Showa era. He developed the fascist ideas of the Kodoa and led the national spiritual mobilization movement to promote the holy war against China. After the war Araki was tried and sentenced to life imprisonment but was released in 1955 with all the other major convicts. Kodahito Kanon was chief of staff of the army from 1931 to 1940. During his mandate, the army committed the Nanking Massacre and regularly used chemical weapons in China. Kanan was one of the main proponents of state Shinto. He died before the end of the war. Hajime Sugiyama was Minister of the Army from 1937 to 1938, then Chief of Staff from 1940 to 1944. During this period, the army kept using chemical weapons and implemented the Sanko Sakasan. He committed suicide in 1945. Yoshijiro Umazu was the chief of staff from 1944 to 1945. Hiroyasu Fushimi was chief of staff of the Navy from 1932 to 1941. Starting in 1937, the Imperial Japanese Navy Air Service implemented strategic bombing of Chinese cities such as Shanghai and Guangzhou. He was exonerated from criminal prosecutions with all members of the Imperial family by SCAP. Osami Nagano was Chief of Staff of the Navy from 1941 to 1944. During this period, the Imperial Japanese Navy Air Service committed the attack of Pearl Harbor and the strategic bombing of Chongqing. He was tried before the Tokyo Tribunal but died in prison before his sentence was carried out. Isoroku Yamamoto was Commander-in-Chief of the Imperial Japanese Navy from 1939 to 1943 and was responsible for Japan's early naval victories, including the attack on Pearl Harbor. 
Considered the most brilliant Japanese naval commander of the war, his death in 1943 deprived the military of a skilled tactician and was a severe blow to Japanese morale. Tamayuki Yamashita was Lieutenant General of the Japanese Imperial Army from 1905 to 1945. He was most famous for conquering the British colonies of Malaya and Singapore, earning the nickname, the Tiger of Malaya. He was hanged on 23 February 1946. Masaharu Homa was a general in the Imperial Japanese Army, most noted for his victory in conquering the Philippines in the Philippines Campaign. Jisaburo Ozawa was an admiral in the Imperial Japanese Navy, commander of the Japanese forces in the Battle of the Philippine Sea in June 1944. He was the last commander-in-chief of the Japanese fleet. Tadamichi Kuribayashi was commander of the Japanese forces who was killed at the Battle of Iwo Jima. Isamu Yokoyama was commander of Japanese forces in China. Shigeyoshi Inoue was commander of the Japanese forces at the Battle of the Coral Sea. Iwane Matsui Prince Yasuhiko Asaka Topic Finland 1941 to 1944 Carl Gustav Emil Mannerheim was the commander in chief of the Finnish defense forces and a marshal of Finland Kiosti Kallio was the fourth president of Finland Risto Raiti was 5th President of Finland and the 14th Prime Minister of Finland. Johan Wilhelm Rangel was the Prime Minister of Finland 1941-1943. Erik Heinrichs commanded the Army of Karelia during the Continuation War. Karl Leonard Osh commanded the Army of Karelia and Annas Group during the Trench Warfare phase of the Continuation War. Jarl Lundqvist commanded the Finnish Air Force during the Continuation War. Vaino Valve commanded the Finnish Navy during the Continuation War. Topic: <inaudible> Kingdom of Romania, 1940 to 1944. Ion Antonescu was the Prime Minister of Romania and the Conducator leader with dictatorial powers from 1940 to 1944. He was sentenced to death and executed in 1946. Michael I was king from 1940 until 1947. He was installed by Antonescu to replace Michael's father Carol II. He was not intended to have much power. He led a coup to overthrow Antonescu and switched sides to the Allies in 1944. Ion Gigurtu was the Prime Minister of Romania from July to September 1940, right before Antonescu. A committed Germanophile, he took the first major steps for the integration of Romania into the Axis, including the withdrawal of Romania from the League of Nations the 11th of July and the enacting of a local version of the Nuremberg Laws the 9th of August. Carol II was king from 1930 to 1940. He named Gigurtu and then Antonescu as prime ministers, being forced to resign by the latter after giving him dictatorial powers. Helen of Greece and Denmark, mother of Michael I, criticized by Nazi Germany for being the real power of the country. Constantine Sanitescu was the Prime Minister 1944. Nikolai Radescu was the Prime Minister 1944-45. Petra Dumitrescu commanded the Romanian Third Army on its campaign against the Soviet Union. Konstantin Constantinescu Klaps commanded the Romanian Fourth Army. Emanuel Ionescu commanded the Royal Romanian Air Force. Ermil Gorgio commanded the Royal Romanian Air Force. Horia Maselaru commanded the Royal Romanian Navy. Horia Sima was head of the pro-Nazi government in exile. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Kingdom of Thailand 1940 to 1945. Ananda Mahadal was king of Thailand from 1935 until his death in 1946. During the war, Mahadal stayed in neutral Switzerland. He returned to Thailand in 1945 after the war. Plake Fibusankram was field marshal of the Thai army and was prime minister of Thailand from 1938 until 1944. The Pibulsongram regime embarked upon a course of economic nationalism and anti-Chinese policies. In 1940, he decided to invade Indochina in hostilities known as the French-Thai War. In 1941, he allied Thailand with Japan and allowed it to use the country for the invasions of Burma and Malaya. 
When Japanese defeat was imminent, he was pressured to resign in 1944. Jaron Ratanakan Sararangrat was a general who commanded Pyapt Army that occupied the Shan state of British Burma. Finn Chonhaven commanded the Pyapt Army S Third Division before being made military governor of the Shan states. Preeti Banamyang, a former revolutionary and cabinet minister, was appointed to the Regency Council in 1941. By 1944, he became sole regent and de facto head of state, but this position was only nominal. He secretly became leader of the resistance forces or the Free Thai Movement in 1942. Kuang Afewang, Prime Minister of Thailand, 1944-45. Client state and protectorate of Axis Topic. Independent state of Croatia 1941 to 1943. Ante Pavelic, of the Independent State of Croatia from 1941 to 1945. Tomislav II, the Italian-born King of Croatia. Nikola Mandic, Prime Minister under Pavelic from 1943 to 1945. Miladin Lorkovic, the Foreign Minister and Minister of the Interior of the Independent State of Croatia NDH. Slavko Kvaternik, Minister of Defense. Vladimir Laksa, Army Chief of Staff. Vladimir Kren, was the Commander of the Air Force of the Independent State of Croatia. Edgar Angeli, was the Commander of the Navy of the Independent State of Croatia. Vekislav Luburic, was the commander of the Croatian Armed Forces. Juri Francetic, was the commander of the Black Legion. Marko Mesic, was the commander of the Croatian Legion. Andro Vrkl Jan, was the commander of the Croatian Naval Legion. <inaudible> French state 1940-1942 Philippe Payton was an army marshal and chief of state of Vichy France from its establishment in 1940 until the invasion of Normandy in 1944. The Payton government collaborated with the Nazis, and organized raids to capture French Jews. The Payton government was opposed by General de Gaulle's Free French Forces, and eventually fell to them. After the war, Payton was tried for treason and sentenced to life in prison. Pierre Laval was Payton's head of government in 1940, and from 1942 to 1944. Under his second government, collaboration with Nazi Germany intensified. In 1945, Laval was tried for treason, sentenced to death and executed. René Bousquet was the deputy head of the Vichy police force. Joseph Darnand was the commander of the paramilitary French militia. A pro-Nazi leader, he was a strong supporter of the Hitler and Payton governments. He established the Millis to round up Jews and fight the French resistance. He was tried for treason and executed after the war. Jean Decaux was the governor-general of French Indochina representing the Vichy government. Decaux's task in Indochina was to reverse the policy of appeasement towards the Japanese led by his predecessor General Georges Catru, but political realities soon forced him to continue down the same road. Arrested and tried after the war, Decaux was not convicted. Topic. Slovak Republic 1939 Jozef Tiso, President of the Slovak Republic. Wojciech Tuka, Prime Minister. Ferdinand Katlos was commander of the Field Army Bernalak during the invasion of Poland. Rudolf Pilfusek was commander of the SS Heimaschitz Slovakia. Augustin Millar Jan Golian Topic. Puppet states of Nazi Germany Topic. Protectorate of Denmark 1940-1945 Leonard Kaupisch, military commander of Denmark. Werner Best, served as a civilian administrator in Denmark. Eric Scavenius, Prime Minister of Denmark from 1942-1943. He pursued a collaborative policy with the German occupation force until he dissolved the Danish government in 1943, and was replaced by German martial law. Fritz Clausen, National Socialist Workers' Party of Denmark Christian Peter Krissing, was commander of the Free Corps Denmark. 
Christian Frederick von Schalberg, was commander of the Free Corps Denmark. Knud Borga Martinsen, was commander of the Schalberg Corps. Topic. Province of Ljubljana Leon Rupnik, was the president of the provincial government. Gregorij Rosman Ernest Peterlin, Battle of Turgic Castle Topic. Norwegian National Government 1940 Vidkun Quisling, Minister-President of the Norwegian National Government from 1942 to 1945. Kjeld Stubb Ergens Ragnar Skank Svir Riesnes Jonas Lai, Minister of Police and SS Standartenfuhrer of the Germanic SS Norway. Karl Marthensen, General of Police, Head of Norwegian STAPO and SIPO He was assassinated by the resistance in 1945 due to increasing power and influence over the Norwegian military. Sophus Kars, was commander of the SS Ski Jaeger Battalion Norwegian. Arthur Qvist, was commander of the Norwegian Legion. Government of National Salvation, Serbia 1941-1944 Milan Medic, General and Prime Minister of the Government of National Salvation. Milan Akimovic Dmitri Jelotic, ZBOR Dragomir Jovanovic, was commander of the Serbian State Guard. Kosta Muziki, was commander of the Serbian Volunteer Corps. Kosta Pekanak, was commander of the Pekanak Chetniks. Momčilo Dujic, was commander of the Dinara Division. Strahinja Janjic, was commander of the 1st Belgrade Special Combat Detachment. <laughs> Puppet states of the Kingdom of Italy <laughs> Albanian Kingdom 1940 Sheke Verlesi, Prime Minister of the Albanian Kingdom. Tefik Maborja, Albanian Fascist Party Topic. Kingdom of Montenegro 1941-1943 Sekula Durljevic was founder of the Montenegrin Federalist Party and Prime Minister of the Kingdom of Montenegro until his imprisonment in 1941. Blazo Dukanovic was later military leader of Montenegro, as head of the Central Nationalist Committee, from 1942 to 1943. Pavla Derisic was commander of the Montenegrin Volunteer Corps. Krsto Popovic was commander of the Lovsen Brigade. <laughs> <laughs> Joint German-Italian puppet states Hellenic State 1941 Georgios Solokoglu was Prime Minister of the Greek Collaborationist Government from April 30, 1941 to December 2, 1942. Konstantinos Logothetopoulos was Prime Minister from December 2, 1942 to April 7, 1943. Ioannis Rallis was Prime Minister from April 7, 1943 to October 12, 1944. Georgios Bakos Minister of Defense. Topic. Puppet states of Imperial Japan Topic. State of Burma 1943 to 1945. Bama, political leader. Topic. Kingdom of Cambodia 1945. Sisawith Manavong was the king from 1927 until his death in 1941. Norodom Sihanouk was the king following Manavong's death. Sun Nok Tan, Prime Minister. Topic. Republic of China Nanjing 1940 to 1945. Wang Jingwei, Head of State, President of the Executive Yuan and Chairman of the National Government, officially known as the Republic of China. Chen Gongbo, Head of the Legislative Yuan. 
Zhou Fohai, head of the executive yuan. Topic: <laughs> Provisional Government of Free India, 1943 to 1945. Subhas Chandra Bose, Head of State, the Prime Minister and the Minister for War and Foreign Affairs of the Free India Government. Topic. Kingdom of Laos 1945. Fetsarath Ratanavangsa, Prime Minister from 1942 to 1945 and Vice King. Topic. Great Manchu Empire Puyi was the Emperor of Manchukuo from 1934 until the disestablishment of the state in 1945. He was installed by the Japanese after the invasion of Manchuria. He was captured and imprisoned by the Soviet Union, and later handed over to the People's Republic of China. Zhang Jingui was the Prime Minister of Manchukuo. Zhang was a Chinese general and politician during the warlord era who collaborated with the Japanese to establish Manchukuo. After the war, he was captured and imprisoned by the Red Army. Shi Qia was the finance superintendent of Manchukuo in 1932, a minister of Manchukuo in 1934, and palace and interior minister in 1936. At the end of World War II he was captured by the Soviets and held in a Siberian prison until he was returned to China in 1950, where he died in prison. Chong Hai Peng, general of the Manchukuo Imperial Army. Mengjiang United Autonomous Government Demchugdingrub was the vice chairman, then the chairman. In 1941 he became chairman of the Mongolian Autonomous Federation. Li Shuxin Second Philippine Republic 1943 Jose P. Laurel, President Topic. Empire of Vietnam 1945. Bao Dai was the King of Annam from 1926 until 1945 and Emperor of Vietnam from 1945 until 1949. Tran Trong Kim, Prime Minister. Topic. See also Axis powers of World War II Allied leaders of World War II Commanders of World War II References, <references>